Hello everybody, I'm Sub-07. Uh, I've been gambling recently, and uh, I have a bit of an announcement to make. 21! I won! Suck my dick! Suck my dick! Yeah! <laughs> oh my god. Back to another uh, lovely session of Pokemon Crystal Na Randomizer Nuzlocke. I almost said Nandomizer. That's not a word. What? what I've what? done that kind of mistake so many times, Yuri. I, oh. have, I was not here last session, so I have absolutely no idea what happened. Well... I haven't been following the videos at all, so I am completely lost. Essentially, I fumbled around for most of the session because we thought for sure that we had missed the Eevee. We didn't. The Eevee was just a Nidoran, and I completely forgot about it, so I had to look back for past footage. And, uh, I came to a conclusion. It'd be safer if I were to go to the gambling shop and, uh, pick up some- pick up a certain Pokemon in particular. I'm not is gonna pick up Mew. Is that what I say? Is it Mew here? <laughs> yeah, Mew's here! Uh, we're not getting it, though, because it's kinda useless, because I Wait, checked its if, moves. If this is a randomizer, how do you know what- where they are? What? Yes, it says it right there. <laughs> That's how uh, I know. So, Fair apparently, enough. uh, there was a Joker leak in Injustice. Yeah. Maximilian well, Hoffman. And, and a Dark Side leak, though we already knew Dark anyway. Side. Well, yes, but I wasn't expecting that design. It's like. <laughs> at least, at least a little yet. bit freaky. A lot of the designs in Injustice 2 are just like. We made them edgy and realistic. More realistic than normal. I, yes, I, Joker I, no I really longer has his cartoonish design. face, but now he's just kind of disturbing now. Yep. People compared him to Mark Hamill and Dark Knight Joker. Even like. Like actual dark Mark Hamill's face, or yeah, like they like that's the type of motif that 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 Joker in Injustice Two has. Well, with the uh, with, with the flat, what, what do you mean with the flat hat, the trench coat? Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay, who should so I deposit I mean... to pick up the Scyther, Patrick or or Lighthouse? I'd say Clicker, since you you're giving rid of a bug for another bug. Yeah, good point. So um, uh, what? So how many gyms have been beaten so far? We're on our way to Sea and Wood, so we're going to get our fifth badge. Okay. Like, I'm picking Seeing up the Scyther what? first, and then dropping it off in the daycare, because it'll be a bit underleveled. We'll be coming yeah, back for I'm it just, later. I'm just gonna say this now, Gen 2 is the one I have the least experience with. You monster. Is CN Wood Morty? No, CN Wood's Chuck. We already did Morty, remember? Right, okay. I wonder what I Chuck's gonna have. To have been here in a while, folks. To be so fair, we haven't had a proper session since last week, but before that, it was at least four months. Like, it's been a long-ass time. Like, by this time, the Switch is out, Mario Kart 8 comes out tomorrow, get hype. The gorillas I, need, I still need money for a Switch. Ugh. Scyther! It's very proud of its speed. It moves so fast that its opponent does not even know what, the, what, what knocked it down. And I already know the perfect name for it. Oh. B7. No, not, no, not B7. King me, king me, I lose. Stark? Tony Stark. Yep. Okay, uh, how did you name get that? that? <laughs> How'd you, how, who, who did you name that again? Stark. I mean, no, I mean, like, who did you name Either. that? Uh, okay. Stark is it because it's, is it because Sizzle. it's, uh, yeah, it's because Scissor looks like an Iron Man? Yes. Looks Fire. like an Iron Man. He looks exactly. like an Iron Man. Or an iron bug, really? Superman. I Superman. am iron bug. I am the ice cream man running over fat kids in my van. Has anybody, like, <laughs> seen the Iron Giant? Because apparently that's an underrated... Yeah. I've seen I Iron Giant, movie. it's a great movie. I liked it, Vin Diesel was in it. It Superman. was decent. Uh, kinda, kinda lost in how, why he flew into space and exploded, but eh. Superman. I think he might have had a nuke in him, but whatever. Yeah, one of the the army to try and get rid of it because it was because because he... that one guy was an a hole. Yeah. It's the detective guy. Yeah. Thought the kid was dead. Went on a rampage. They were just like, our weapons aren't doing anything. Detective wanted to be a jerk, and then just like just launched a nuke to try and get rid of it. Iron Giant saw that the kid was okay, calmed down, but then saw that there was still a nuke heading for everybody. And so he grabbed it, went into space, made a Superman joke, and died.
and no. it exploded. It was like in like launching up to space and then about to fall down. Hello, sir. I, I, the Iron Giant like flew up and then crashed into it in space, quietly saying Superman to itself. Superman. And millions of children cried because of that scene. Yes. Yep. I mean, yeah. And then at the end, it showed like a like a mid credit scene where he's reassembling himself again, kind of like Goddard from Jimmy Neutron. God, I wish like I could see that show again. <laughs> that was oh, a Jimmy good. Neutron? I miss Jimmy Neutron. Like, it was a good show. I don't know show. why, but like it aged like badly, but not in like the graphical kind of way, because it's like still really smooth. Is that what I say? Do you mean it just visuals? Because like here's like here's a. <laughs> I, don't I know it's, like, it's all like really smooth and shit. It's just that it. I, I think it's because I haven't seen it in such a long time that it's just kind of really weird looking to me. Is that what I say? I don't want to break your heart, but those PS2 games don't look as good as you thought they I don't want to break your heart, but there's this thing that I might need to introduce you to. It's called Donkey Kong Country! Uh, hold on, I gotta go AFK. I'll be back in a moment. Okay. Mm. Alright. But, yeah, That's like... For... the thing. Are you talking about the games or the show? The show. Mmm. <laughs> I have no regrets saying that. Uh... Here's the thing, though. I've not seen a full episode of that show. I've only seen clips. I've also never played any of the Donkey Kong Country games unless you count returns. I count Which returns. I the first world, then got stuck at the temple and said, well, I'm not beating this game ever. <laughs> well, you went for one of the hardest levels in the game right after the first world. Of course, you were stuck on it. Yeah. I thought that it was going to be okay to play that game like a normal platformer, just beating every stage that unlocks until I've completed the world and then move on to the next. Well, you completed the world. The temple's the bonus after the world that you don't I approach did. unless you're a nut. I never played a Donkey Kong game. Then there's me. Then there's me who's got at least percent on Returns 3D. <laughs> You're looking at the guy who 100% uh, of returns you know, in Tropical Freeze. I'm still, I'm still playing, uh, I'm still working on Tropical Freeze, but lately I've been playing lots of Persona, so that's kind of been on hold. <sighs> oh shit! I'll Accidentally screen captured. Yeah, hey people, Persona 5 came out finally. Go play it. So good. It didn't get delayed again, guys. Don't worry. <laughs> Go play it. Don't, don't close the video though. Just have our video running in the background, please. We need the ad revenue. I gotta feed my kids. Need the we need the views because YouTube's changed its policies again. Yeah, cause YouTube's YouTube. Uh. Oh, it's Wall Street Journal's a jerk. Yeah, <laughs> fuck Wall Street. Okay, now what? Route what? Forty. What? We have Wall not Street? caught any Pokemon on uh, yet. Uh, okay, I don't really follow all the people who live on it. <laughs> I, I don't really follow all the um, policy stuff exactly. What? How did Wall Street affect this? Wall Street made an article that was just like, hey, YouTube has ads playing on racist and supremacy videos, and then contacted, like, McDonald's, AT&T, and Starbucks, and other types of big, like, um, ad, like, people. They were giving, like, most of the money in, in terms of ad revenue to YouTube, and when they folded and, like, left, YouTube was left with uh, not a lot of money, so they took, like, precautions. Those precautions basically saying, hey, anybody who doesn't have at least 10,000 views in a lifetime cannot apply for ad revenue. God damn it, YouTube. Well, the good news is uh, we already have over 10,000 views, so we're safe on that front. Yeah, we're safe in yeah. case we ever want to do ad revenue, but I would suggest that we get a bigger like audience before asking for something like that. Yeah, I don't plan on doing that anytime soon. Ugh. <laughs> Wouldn't even know what we would do with ad revenue besides like divide it amongst the members. But Which, then I'd say yeah, twelve members. How are we going to do okay, that? Let me put it this way: on my personal channel, I get like if I'm lucky, five cents a month. I don't get paid. <laughs> <laughs> the end. And that's why I said we expand our audience because like, like you can't make like you can't make money off of like. 20 people. Oh, you son of a bitch! How dare you use that against me! You monster. I mean, it'd take forever, but... You dare use my favorite Pokemon line against what? me. Your life is forfeit. I will make you pay Maybe for doing this like to me. in like three years, you're gonna afford a candy bar. <laughs> ah. Well, I suppose I could buy a candy bar, I guess. <laughs> that reference is gonna fly over so many people's heads. Are you referencing me as a bird? <laughs> yes! If was, I had I a... to see... was I supposed to see something there? Nah, it's a clip show. Okay. okay. 
<laughs> Alright, let's see what we can find. Right. Come on. Big money, big money, new encounter. What do we oh, got? Um, big money. By, by the way, uh... By the way, ah! Ellie, uh, when is that Undernight so Inverse latest cool. thing coming out? I don't fucking care. <laughs> Randomizers are fun. Whee! Um, so, uh, hey, uh, Yuri, when does that updated version of Undernight in Birth come out? Because uh... I honestly forget. I am so goddamn happy right now, because if I can get this on my team, we have our new fire type, and it's my uh, favorite Pokemon. Fresh off the presses. Nintendo to skip E3 press conference in 2017. Uh, okay. That's what they usually do. <laughs> Nintendo will not host a large-scale press conference during okay. E3 2017. Domini said during its financial results briefing for the fiscal year, which ended in March 2017, the video game trade show E3 will be held in Los Angeles this June. Nintendo president said, Again this year we will not be hosting a large-scale press conference for institutional investors, analysts, and the media. Nintendo of America will present further information on our plans at a later date. All right, okay. then. All right. So I just... Uh, so I I read that headline I thought it was just like, Nintendo's not doing anything this E3. They're not even going! <laughs> like that's what I because I line. I knew for a fact that was bullshit because I know that I know they have a large boot space because I've been checking floor plans. That they, was, see, I, I like that's what I thought. So sorry to alarm people. Um, a large, a large. Holy crap! Uh, Bomberman R what? World shipments top five hundred thousand units. Awesome. Huh. That's great. I think we're going to see another Bomberman, so Bomberman is... Yay! We saved hey. the franchise. I like Rain. Bomberman. Oh. Uh, like, it's, it's one of the <sighs> first games I'm going to be getting once I get a Switch. You have no but idea don't how make this makes Zero me. again. <laughs> they hopefully learned their lesson. <laughs> this is Konami. I said hopefully! <laughs> and with this, we have the most valuable member of the team. You Pay already have a Raikou. We have the other most valuable member of the team, Pedro. Have a Scyther. <laughs> this is our third most valuable. This is our fourth most valuable member. Fifth. But your sneeze will die. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> oh, you lost. Wait, you lost a sneeze. My starter was a sneezel. It got blown up. Wood and it died. Uh. Session four. <laughs> like, uh, that's one thing. <gasps> Oh, that's right. You missed session. Se oh, you missed our. You missed our incredible bomb luck. Mm. Uh, click, I, I should mention again. Uh, this is like pretty much the first footage, technically, I'm seeing of the entire series. Essentially, <laughs> let's just say that Sub had a ditto called Bob, and un as as you would expect, at some point it ran into another ditto. Yeah. <laughs> you also Hilarity ensued. You also missed the best part of when. Oh my goodness. Last session, we were fi uh, we were going up, I was, I think I was doing the lighthouse off session, but before I stopped that, um, I encountered a trainer who had another coughing, and it blew up on Clicker. He survived. <laughs> He's our first uh. person to survive an explosion. Uh. You also missed when, like, during session three, when Sub was trying to, like, hatch an egg, that I read the stats of what explosion did. <laughs> yeah. And then I also looked up self-destruct, because apparently they have different things, even though they do the same thing. Uh, aren't they, like, slightly different attack stats or something? Yeah, they're different. Because of how Gen 1 and Gen 2 deals with, like, explosion and self-destruct, by technicality, explosion does 300 base damage <laughs> and negate defense. Jesus. But self-destruct does, like, 250 but t but takes defense into account. That's oh. the thing that separates the two. Oh, I am Oh, Gens yeah. after this are just like, eh, they're just one move or the other. Uh, I'm, so, I'm oh, yeah. so glad that we did not get stuck with Farfetch'd and we got my favorite starter of all time. Mm. Oh yeah, um, speaking of, um, uh, luck in game, in Pokemon, you guys go- 21! So what did I miss? Uh, I found my starter in the ocean. He found a he found a Cyndaquil in the in the ocean for some reason. Commotion but in also the ocean. Found, he would have found a Farfetch, so he was thanking RN Jesus for not giving him. Praise be to Arceus. Oh wait, Arceus and, and didn't exist it, yet. RN Jesus. Then it was what I. RN Jesus. 
RNG CSS. That's, that's stretching it a bit. Th- then there was when I was cursing RNGs like a few days ago. You guys, if you remember the group chat, will not rem- should remember that full well. Or pretty much anyone who follows my Twitter. So good God. Anyway. Oh wow, uh, more fire types. Who uh, would have thought? For those of you, so In for those of you new to the to the situation, by the way, I had the worst luck with a Clefable ever. Oh god, that was funny. Yeah. Oh, uh, were you fighting Lucamine? Yes. Okay. Again, I'm just like so confused on what your type matchup was and like what your team. No, 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 no. no. It wasn't my team that was the problem. It was a fucking Fable. Oh god, not again. I almost pulled a Lucagen there. I almost said Kaflable. Damn you, smokescreen! <laughs> <laughs> okay, Yuri, Yuri. Kaflable? Yuri, to refresh your memory fully, the Clefable used metronome and gave itself both aqua rain and ingrain. It Trust knew me. cosmic power and buffed its de- both defense tests to high heaven. Trust um, me, I and remember it- your bad luck, but still... <laughs> Yeah, we're still and laughing the, our ass off at it, though. You can counteract problems like that. Now, even super effective moves were ba- it were barely dealing anything. Oh, for God's sake. See, now this, see, now oh, this is sake. when the difference of opinion in decent a team comes out. And coming! Where's, where some people think the decent team just means that you have Pokemon that can be, like, super effective against a lot of other types. Well, no, it's not that I was decently leveled for this, too. That's the That's the thing. It just so happens, it buffed its defense test to high heaven, its ability prevented poison from taking effect. Uh-oh. It, it, and it gave <sighs> itself and a metronome would not make it use fucking explosion. Triforce, you can't- I was just kinda of hoping that would happen. Uh, Triforce, you're- A ton. <sighs> you're, you're roboticizing here. Fuck you, Deli Bird! You tried to kill Inferno! Oh, and he's evolving! Because he's past level 16 for some reason. Yay! Uh, uh, I think I just. Also, also Yuri, if that, that was its lead Pokemon, so even if I did somehow beat it, there was still the other, like, four Pokemon I'd have to deal with. I uh. know, and also to your point of saying that like you were at like le- like high levels and stuff, like like no, again, I, I like, said with decently level, game, not super level high levels. levels. Don't matter. This is how people could beat the Elite Four like twenty levels lower than the actual Pokemon they're fighting. I'm looking at you, Gen Six. It is. I hit it with badly poisoned, and that's how I found out it had Magic Guard. Huh. So his so poisoning was completely oh, worthless. Yeah, I'm, oh, uh, so, uh... Conversation. <laughs> what is I it, guess on, I don't know, on to other news, Marvel vs. Capcom. Uh, so hyped. <laughs> yes. Why is, so, like, you know how when you brought that up and I was saying, like, I don't see that game coming out this year? It's coming out this year. It's coming out this year. It's coming out earlier than everyone thought, even the people who knew it was coming out this year. Here, Why is it this coming picture. out this year? No one knows. What? That game better have a roster bigger than 20 people. <laughs> like, well, we already have 14 characters confirmed. Well they're, and, uh, six, well, they're six away from, like, a decent roster in that franchise. Well, knowing well, them, I mean, they like, got a lot more coming. It was, like, 50. See, now, some, I would be right there with you, but Street Fighter V exists. They also said, we're not making the same mistakes as we did with Street Fighter V. Hopefully. I'm like, like, Capcom is in this weird thing where when they do something good, I'm all with them in everything they do, but when they screw up, I'm the most judgmental human being I could ever possibly be about them. Yeah. Judge, 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 judge. Phase right now, and until they prove me wrong, I think they're going to make the worst games ever. So, who wants some roasted duck? <laughs> with fresh onion. Oh. Can we put just a roast, roasted duck with duck sauce on the side? And fresh onion. It's like that. It's like that picture of just like a person like um covering chicken with like like breaded chicken flour. It's like I'm rubbing you into the essence of your children. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy. So, anyways, 
uh, speaking of Marvel vs. Capcom, here's this. I posted a picture. Go look at it. Uh, I, I, I saw that on social media. Uh, future whoever uh, put this picture on screen. Thanks. Buzz Lightyear versus I forget his name equals Sigma. Zer. Oh, Buzz and uh, Zer equals, it's equals Zer. Sigma. In, in Toy Story 2, they Can made you a Star tell Wars that I haven't seen Toy Story in years? You need to. I haven't seen Toy Story in years either, and I even remember the guy's name. <laughs> They, they made a Star Wars joke out of that, Yuri. So? I didn't know what Star Wars was when I saw that movie. <laughs> Fair <Wow>. enough. <laughs> like, you forget that movie came out like, what, like 1999? 1998. 1998. Well, 1998. Toy Story 2 was when they made the joke, though. So. 2000. Yeah. All right, random swimmer boy, what do you have to throw at me? Yeah, like, old Star Wars the 70s or something like the closest that I would have ever found out about Star Wars would have been like like the mid to early 2000s where the tr where the like the prequel trilogy came out Come on, kid. Meanwhile, my, meanwhile my family owned the VHS set of the uh, original trilogy I guess in any case everyone's saying that Sigma looks like Buzz Lightyear if he I don't see it evil. I don't see it I do I just see but Sigma. But then again, Sub and Yuri, you've played Mega Man X a lot. Yeah. Because <laughs> that's like one of like eight incarnations of Sigma. Uh, yes, he's got like objection. a lot. Objection. The only Mega Man X game I played was the first X, and you could see the four hours of me trying to play that game for the first time <laughs> yes, you can. on the channel. Fair enough. For those <laughs> of you who are interested, please check out Tournament Arc. Is where Sigma doesn't even exist. <laughs> Yep, the only game where, in, in the X-Series where Sigma doesn't exist. Uh... <laughs> what a game to start, am I right? 10 out of 10, 10 out of 10. Yeah. A person that I, I was watching a person Let's Play Command Mission, and it took them until, like... It took them until Reddips, like, betrayed everybody to realize the part with... the realize the big twist with his name. <laughs> Whoops. What was, his, what was his name again? Edips, if you spell it backwards, is Spider, which was a party member who looked like he had sacrificed himself. But oh, yeah, well, um, could be bad I got spoiled time. on that. Oh, yeah, like, partway through playing the game, I got spoiled on that by one of QG's lists. It's the where best he goes about that is that if you look up Reddits in the in the instruction manual, Capcom purposely misspelled the name so that people wouldn't catch on immediately. Yep. <laughs> They're but, very yeah, um, conniving. But you know, th this was me when watching one of QG's lists. I, th um, I think it might have been on like card wielders or uh, I don't know or something, but or or gamblers or something. So it's just like, oh yeah, by the way, he by the way he's also spider. Spoiler warning. Well, fuck you too. <laughs> Whirlpool. Whirlpool. Oh, okay. There might be a Nintendo Switch version of Tekken Seven. Uh, no. There's a. There's a, the Tekken 7 dev has never even had the time to check out a Switch port yet. I said might. That doesn't equate to, I'm good, there's gonna be a port. That equates to, I don't even think there's gonna be even a chance of it happening. Fair enough. I would like Tekken 7 on the Switch. I mean, it'd be awesome. Oh, there's a Vaporeon out here? Well, you missed that, but at least you got your Cyndaquil. Well, I mean, just here, look at this. I already I have two water this. types, so I'm satisfied. Yeah, that's fair. But Vaporeon. <laughs> It's not Jolteon, though. At least it's not Flareon. Yeah. <laughs> Flareon is worst, is worst evolution. And then Glaceon. Why, does Fla Why are there so many Pokemon that suck and then continue to suck as the games got, like, more added to them? I'm still waiting for Entei to be a great legendary, but it's not. Like, you would think that, if, that like, Pokemon Gen 1 up to 4 would get, like... Balanced. And I'm still waiting for Dunsparce to get an evolution. I would like that, because, like... I... W My whole thing is that I hate that Pokemon... I hate that there are Pokemon that are just plain out useless. Yep. Because no one uses Dunsparce, no one uses Love Disc, no one uses... Fucking... Correction, Jacob uses Dunsparce and he's an idiot. We all know that he's an idiot, though. Is the thing. Yeah, Jacob does challenge runs, though. That's not, like, a fair thing to bring up. Well, this one, I think it... There's a giraffe ring out here? Okay. 
Like he's trying to do the backwards is giraffe rig. Alamomola backwards is Alamomola. Arbok backwards is Cobra. Ekans backwards is Snake. Muck backwards is no. <laughs> <laughs> Don't even finish that thought, you. You Narakami. <laughs> Kikaku Dolly. Wait a minute, you're not the you're not that person. Uh, also, like, watch my God, Triforce brought this up like, probably like ten, maybe fifteen minutes ago. But, <laughs> um, oh, hang on, wild up encounter for seeing what what we got. Okay, the updated, <laughs> the updated release of Under Night and Birth in Japan comes out July twentieth. We don't have an English date yet. In Japan. Noted. For anybody at home, though, Under Night and Birth. For somehow got it got its updated release ported over here. So not only are we getting those two fighters we never got that were stuck in arcades, we're getting a new character that got teased in one of the villains' endings. Now also, if only we could get we the arcade editions for Pokémon. Now, if only we could get the arcade editions for Pokémon. I'm still waiting to get Scizor and Darkrai. Pretty badass. Just wait, it'll happen and Napoleon. Just wait for the Switch port. All right, we have acquired a Doduo. What should I call it? It's on the horizon. What should I call Doduo? Neki. Excuse me? I don't know. <laughs> like you think like you tell me to think of a name on the spot, I'm gonna give you something with a Y at the end of it. <laughs> Neki. Brilliant. <laughs> Odds of success uh fifteen percent. I don't think it's gonna last long. Well, uh, to, and then uh, another news, uh, to, to the surprise of absolutely nobody, uh, Nintendo's still not doing a press conference, another direct. We already discussed that, actually. We discussed right. that earlier while you were off at break. Well, I, I, I misconstrued that headline as Nintendo's just not going to E3 this year, but instead it's just, oh, they're doing another digital event thing. Yes. Yay. Alright, time to get some quick cash in order to buy some more of Ice for the Elite Four. Oh, the yeah. gym leader uses fighting types? I don't believe you. Mm. Not for Fair. a goddamn second. I'm now remembering my first. I'm now remembering my first uh, randomizer nuzlocke where I successfully got to the first gym and ended up going up against a crowbat. I mean, I encountered a crowbat in the fourth gym. And I had a turtwig. Oh yeah, you brought this up actually. Yeah. I'm surprised I made it that far, and then Team Rock, Team Platinum with Jinx, or Team Galactic. But been a while since I played Gen Gen Four. It was my first Gen, but it's been a while. Now let's <laughs> see. I believe shame. over here, if I recall correctly, up here is there. It is. Gen Four is the best Gen. So why haven't you played it more often? Hang on. It was my That's first Gen, wrong. actually. Watch um, out! It's, we got we got an interaction with uh, Apom over here. Watch out, here comes the Apom beast. Bye, Apom! Yo, Sub Zero, wasn't that sweet right, just yeah, now? So no, I've it was Apom! Like five battle royales God, I and I've got how, one one. I forgot how 90s this game was to the point where I went, like, you seen doesn't say yo! <laughs> what happens to the graceful man in a purple jumpsuit? Uh oh. Oh, wait, he's not here. Oh, that might be bad. Mystical man you seen. Uh, this might be bad. Oh, never mind, we're good. Hey, this might be bad. Sends out an Abra. <laughs> we're good. Crisis averted. <laughs> Don't oh, speak you... before it happens. <laughs> like... Um, oh yeah. With my randomizer nose locks, I've also been randomizing the moves. I mean, You're insane. I mean, every Pokemon here can learn every TM, which we learned last session. <laughs> and I was laughing my ass off at the thought of watching Rykos learn Surf. How the hell did I miss this Zygarde cell? At least now Charizard can finally learn Fly. FINALLY! No, even better, I teach Typhlosion Fly just to... Oh, fuck. Just to spite it. Oh, this this could be a problem, actually. Um... Was this suit a Oh, Wobbuffet. Yeah, that might be a problem! Um, hmm. I don't want to do this. Paralyze and then hope for the best. Yep, okay, playing it safe. Got an idea. 
Using safeguards so I can't lower your stats, that doesn't mean jack diddly squat, because I can do this. I thought... I, I thought... remember safeguard being status effects, not stats. Is that what I say? And then he just proved that by trying to confuse it, and then, like, safeguard blocked it. Yep, that And then, okay. for some reason, you did confuse right Oh, there. that's bad. <laughs> and that's destiny bond. That's not good. Well, GG. Sub is now relearning the entire Wobbuffet move set. That's right. That, well, that on. is the Wobbuffet move set. Discounting That's counter what and mirror code. The entire Wobbuffet move set. The <laughs> only thing it's missing is Magic Guard right now. It doesn't. Which is an ability. Uh. Okay, that's that's and, not a good move. Wait, what's what's the thing that I'm thinking of then? Uh, mirror coat. Mirror coat. That's the name of it. What is that again? Uh, reflects back a special attack for twice the damage. Well, time to do another battle royale because why the hell not? Oh, thank Challenge. God. Okay. I need to win a single one. Let's see if I can win this one. The safeguard Count dissipated, so come on. Ah, damn it. Counter, counter, counter. So Taste anyone, my super oh, sonic. Anyone got any favorites they want for Smash? For not Smash, but all, Marvel Four? You already know that I want a Sora MGM. We all want a Sora. Brain Phoenix back, cause he is my main. I don't know. I like the only Marvel I've played was two, and I played it once. Please don't do what I think yeah. you're gonna do. Please don't do what I think you're gonna do. Come on, don't do it. Don't um, do it. So let let let's see. Well, we are we got X. So as long as we get Phoenix right back, I'm gonna be happy. But for newcomers, <sighs> yeah, a Sora, definitely a Sora. A Sora, Phoenix Wright, and Frank West. I want those three. And Oof. okay. Uh, what about for the Marvel side, though? Uh, let's, uh new newcomers or old or old comers? Cause I got a few. Uh, just name one, uh, two for each. Uh, Ghost Rider and Storm. I want back for the Marvel side for new or old and for new. Let's get Black Panther and Ant Man. Ant Man and, would be interesting. Well, yeah, considering that no Hawkeye's buy. Hawkeye's new. Level 3 Hyper Combo no longer has Ant-Man in it. That's, like, a lot more likely. Deadpool or no buy. <laughs> yeah, Deadpool better show up. Yeah, yeah. me, for, yeah, me Deadpool, Spider-Man. <laughs> like, uh, my main, my main team in... My main team in Ultimate 3 was uh, Phoenix Wright, Deadpool, and Zero. Ooh. But we got Mega Man X, so Ooh. I'm fine if we don't get Zero. That could be Wesker bad. Wesker or no buy. <laughs> I'd appreciate Wesker as well. Okay. Okay. And then, hold on, for like two newcomers, I'd like the new Miss Marvel. That'd be pretty cool because uh, she's got those stretchy powers. Uh, I don't know don't anything don't about Marvel. Don't you mean Marvel, Captain so Marvel? I, I can't. No, that, no I said anybody. the new Miss Marvel. The, the, the Khan. What's her name? Camilla Khan or something in the comics. She's got like. <laughs> new idea. Like... New idea. We get Spawn. No fucking reason why he should be there. Just to put Spawn in. Spawn no. would be put awesome. In, put in Spawn and then make it Soul Calibur Spawn, who has the dumb axe. <laughs> just to really throw people off, just like, what the fuck, why does he have an axe? 